channel if you're new what is up my name is Nicole do not forget to like comment share and subscribe and click that bell so every time I upload a video you guys will be notified in today's video we are doing another wig today this video is in partnership with Tanache hair so thank you so much to Tanache for sponsoring this video they sent over their 13 by 4 lace frontal wig this is 24 inches honey and this is part of their new collection this is the barrel curls unit when I received this wig it did come looking very pretty they barrel curled it and it was so pretty however I was just in a rush to get this video up but I needed to bleach the knots which meant I had to wash the hair which meant that I couldn't enjoy the barrel curls but I will insert a picture right here of the website so you can see exactly what the barrel curled wig looks like in its natural form I did go ahead and straighten the hair because I feel I kind of explained it in the video but I feel like I haven't really enjoyed straight hair in a while I'm usually always curling it or crimping it or doing some some sort of thing to it to give it volume body and bounce but today I just really wanted to just sit back and enjoy the hair being straight I, I rarely wear straight hair like just hair that is straight with no curl no nothing to it so I just really wanted to just do that with this wig the density is really nice I believe this is 150 density so it's your nice like a natural thickness okay it's natural thickness and that's why I thought it'd be perfect to wear sleek straight because I never do that so yeah that's why I did not curl this hair but you can definitely curl it you can crimp it you can do whatever you like to it I just decided to wear it in its natural state and I absolutely love it so I'm just going to quickly show you everything that comes in the box so of course you receive a silk bag can never go wrong with one of these these things are essential if you want your wigs to last um, you get a wig cap in here, love that. You get a bonnet in here, so if you're someone who doesn't have a bonnet or you're on the look for a bonnet, don't worry, Tanasha always has you covered. You get given a straw comb, I love me a good straw comb. You get a edge brush, of course. They give you some really, really, really cute eyelashes. And they also send over some hair clips essential if you are laying your wigs down let me not ramble anymore and let me not talk your ears off because there's gonna be a whole lot of talking in the video so yeah definitely make sure you subscribe like comment and share and all that good stuff if you want me to try any other vendors specifically let me know down below if you are a company and you sell glues lace tints elastic bands bonnets whatever drop me a message my email is down below so if you'd like me to try out your product or anything then give me a shout and we can sort something out <laughs> that round um, but yeah without further ado I hope you enjoy and let's just get right into it all right guys so let's just get right into it um, I do want to say if I look very very pale there's a disclaimer <laughs> it's because I have no moisturizer on I literally just came out of the shower and I'm ready to install this wig my eyebrows also look very dark because I recently got them re microbladed so yeah that is why, um, well, a little side note about me, when it comes to um, applying my wigs and stuff, like from scratch, I don't apply any form of moisturiser to my face beforehand, most of the time. And I know some of you guys are probably thinking like, what, why? Well, moisturiser, you know, just makes the hair, the hair sticks to the oils and stuff, and not your skin, so I don't do it. But um, to start off, I'm going to take some Bold Hold Skin Protect. I've been wanting to get my hands on this for the longest. I swear, you Americans are so lucky. You literally have access to everything. Like, everything. It's not even a joke. It's not even a joke. You lot have access to everything. In the UK, it's so hard to get your hands on like a lot of the things that you want to use. Especially when it comes to like wigs and stuff. Like... I just, ugh, like obviously we have the stuff that we have here, but you guys really, 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 really are blessed and highly favoured because 
why can't we have access to it? Like, do you know what I had to go through to get this bold hold spray? So yeah. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a wig cap. I'm gonna try the um. I'm actually gonna try the bowl cap method. So, uh, so many of my, some of you guys on Snap have been like not getting on to me, but you're like, oh Nicole, try it. We've never seen you do it on camera. Just try it. So why not? First, I'm gonna take some got to be glued just the yellow one and I'm just gonna place bits of this on my hair like so I'm gonna take a rat rat tail comb I'm gonna take an edge brush and I'm gonna brush my hairline back because my braids are getting a little bit old they're not even a month old you guys they're not even a month old but they are a bit loose I washed them today in the shower so they are a little bit um like loose and not as tight i guess as they were before i washed it but it's fine then i'm going to take my blow dryer and i'm just going to blow dry it so it stays that way okay, so now it's time to move on to the um bald cap part um i'm not nervous to do this but something I haven't done before so um, let's give it a try <laughs> got to be spray Okay guys, so we made it. We made it. We got there in the end. <laughs> yeah, I'm quite happy with it. I'm happy with it. I feel like my edges are protected and all that stuff. Um, I cut a little bit too much here, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> all right, so now we're gonna grab the wig. This is what she looks like. I did wash her off camera and I bleached the knots. Um, this wig was so easy to bleach, like it was a dream. It was a dream to bleach these knots. Eunice hair, Tanashi hair, like you already know the quality is gonna be good. You just know. I've never had an issue with those brands before. They just work so well. And as you can see already, just by placing her on and not even like really having to do anything, it looks really, really, really good. I did pluck her off camera a little bit so yeah but, um, okay so to apply my wig i'm gonna use a different glue i ordered this um during christmas and i'm really excited this glue is by a young lady called rico it's called glued up and it's got a watermelon scent and i just really wanted to try it could definitely smell the watermelon in this um it smells really good but yeah just wanted to try it out try different glue you know if you want to send me like glues and stuff if anybody watching this is like a hair vendor um or anything and you want to send over some like wig glues or sprays or tints or anything for me to try definitely give me a shout my email is always linked down below um but yeah i just wanted to give it a try so here we are so i'm just gonna do about two to three layers of this nothing uh too much because i don't know how this glue works based on like the reviews and stuff i've heard this glue is like pretty strong but of course we're going to be testing it out for the first time here so um yeah so i'm just going to apply probably like two two to three layers of this nothing too dramatic nothing too crazy 
Um, I'm not going to keep this wig on for super long, but I do want it to last for at least a week. Because I have quite a busy week ahead and I do not have time to be doing my hair. Okay, so I decided to go with two layers in the end um, because why not, you know? So now I'm just gonna carefully just kind of position it where I want it to be. Like this feels tight. <laughs> this feels like she ain't finna go nowhere. Like she ain't moving, she ain't grooving. This hair feels nice and tight and snug which I love because my meeting really starts in 20 minutes <laughs> so I need to get this on here like now but I really like how this looks like I'm really 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 loving how this is turning out the glue feels so tight oh my like the glue actually feels really tight and this is only two layers I did not do a third layer in the end because um nah let's just, let's just test it out with two for now <laughs> and then um we'll see if i feel like i need to add more a little bit later but so far oh my goodness like this is mad <laughs> let me just tie her up like that boom just like that now we're going to do the part in so so I'm going to take my Care Care wax stick, you guys know the drill, I'm trying to do this bit quite quickly because I'm going to have to hop on a meeting. I'm so silly, who the hell does hair before a meeting? Only Nicole will do this before a meeting. But it's because I have to go somewhere, I have a nail appointment at 5 and I don't have time after my meeting to do my hair. Hence why I'm doing it before like a dodo, but it's fine. So I just finished my meeting <laughs> and you guys wouldn't even believe but basically during the meeting I did this off camera because like there was no need to like do all of this on camera really it had been repetitive just pop combing the hair and straightening the hair and yeah it would have been repetitive but anyways um I made sure my zoom camera was off and you could only hear my audio and I did like parts of the, I basically did the wig off camera this is what it's looking like right now the hair is so soft this hair is so soft it's so shiny there's no product in it and it straightened like a dream it hot combed like a dream and she is flat she is flat so I just I love it when a good wig just does what it's supposed to do yeah so it's been about um it's been like what half an hour now since I've had this band on so I think I'm ready to take her off and see what she is giving and she is giving scalp of course look at this look at this the hair is stuck as well you guys like this hair is stuck down really nicely I do like this glue like I do actually like really like this glue and this is something that I'm gonna continue to use because I like I really like this glue I'm not gonna lie my wig feels very very tight it feels very very snug it does not feel like the glue is lifting anywhere which surprisingly with my bold hold glue sometimes I feel like it does feel like it's low-key lifting a little bit but that's not the case with this like my wig feels really really flat and secure <laughs> and it just looks really nice like i'm very 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 impressed with this so yeah so now what i'm gonna do is i'm just combing the hair up um 
like this so I can kind of see I'm not going to do my baby hairs just yet because I want to cut the lace first but this wig is really nice you guys <gasps> okay you know what I might even do this off camera let me just cut it off camera and then I'll be right back <laughs> Okay, so this is where we're at right now. So I just cut the lace and it looks so friggin good. Like I said, I'm a bit bummed that I kind of over a little bit here, but we're gonna fix it, all right? <laughs> we're gonna fix it, but guys, if I wanted to do no baby hairs with this, uh, it could work. It could work, but of course, you know me, we gotta do the baby hairs. But I just, I'm loving this in store. This glue as well is really, really, really good. I do have a bit of a white cast around my hairline, but that is fine. I'm gonna fix that. Um, but first, I'm just gonna take some of the adhesive remover spray. This is also by Rico. That's the name, Rico Cabello. Really pretty girl. Um, and I'm just gonna spray a little bit of this on a cotton thing. And I'm just gonna lightly kind of just dab it over my skin that way like my skin doesn't have you know like a white cast or anything like that um be very careful when you do this step because obviously it's a it's a remover so you don't want to get it on the lace just get it on your skin um because if you get it on the lace it's obviously going to lift up the lace and that's not what you want okay so now we're going to move on to the baby hairs and I want these baby hairs to be on the lighter side because if you hear noise as well, it's work. <laughs> I have to like keep this on because <coughs> it's work. So um, yeah, so I'm just going to take some from here. And I think too dramatic. I'm going to take a little bit of my olive oil jelly. I'm just going to go over the top of the base. Just the base. Take my got to be, spray my edge brush, and I'm going to swoop these into place. So this is everything. <laughs> I need to tie her down once more so that the baby hairs can like be all solidified and stuff. But for the most part, this is it. <clears throat> I think this has come out, this has turned out to be really pretty. I'm just gonna take some got to be, I'm just gonna got to be these pieces. This is just gonna help further melt everything in really nicely keep everything in place all right you guys so it's been about 25 minutes or so since i last checked in with you we're gonna go ahead and take the elastic band off and yeah i did add a little bit of concealer off camera to my part just to define it a little bit but um, this is what she looks like. Oh, so nice. <laughs> yeah, she looks really, really, really good. Looks nice and natural. Looks like my own hair, actually. Like when I slick back my own hair and my own edges and stuff, this is exactly how it looks. I'm grouped. <laughs> I really, really like how this turned out. This wig is so flat, you guys so 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 flat very 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 straight I just I love how this turned out to think at one point in my life I didn't think I could ever wear a frontal because I don't know why I thought this well I do but I thought that I would never ever ever be able to wear a frontal and I could only do closures boy was I wrong <laughs> boy was I wrong these baby hairs are a little bit on the dramatic side not necessarily the look that I was exactly going for, but we're here, so we just have to kind of roll with it for now. 
which is fine um but i'm very very happy with this install if i do say so myself i'm not gonna wear makeup like i usually do um in this video because my eyebrows are like fresh and i don't want to put products on them or anything while they're healing so that's why i'm not wearing makeup but yeah you guys can see what this looks like against my natural uh self with no makeup at all um we've got to appreciate the natural beauty sometimes um so yeah but i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up make sure you like make sure you comment all that good stuff subscribe everything everything um i love to see it um if you have any video requests from me i know this edge looks a bit different to this one as well i'm gonna fix it off camera but um if you guys want to see anything different from me definitely make sure you let me know down below in the comments if you want me to try any particular brands put that in the comments as well and like i said if you are a vendor and you want to send me anything my email is down below so make sure you check that out and i'm happy to try out any products or anything that you guys have on the website as well as like a review so yeah thank you so much again for Tanache for sponsoring this video I have no complaints about the hair whatsoever it, it didn't tangle it didn't shed I'm playing with it a lot no shedding no tangling I have no complaints Tanache hair is one of the best hairs on the market in terms of like if you want a good 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 quality wig I 100% recommend Tanache you can't go wrong with them I've never gone wrong with them every wig that they've ever sent me the quality has been top-notch like a1 and um, yeah like you just won't be disappointed you won't be disappointed so definitely make sure you check out Tanache all the links and everything to this hair will be down below in the description as well as a coupon code if I have one that'll be there as well um, but yeah I really hope you enjoyed this video take care stay safe and I will see you in the next one